Hi, and welcome back. We are back in the 2021 Tesla Model 3 Long Range, and we finally have a substantive update with a lot of uh, new features. So this is update 2025.2. 2025.2. Uh, before I get in, I want to say thanks to everyone for watching. Thanks for subscribing. If you haven't yet, please click that subscribe button and let's get right into it. Okay, so here we go. 2025.2. So the first thing we have is third party fast charger. So what this one does, basically, if you navigate to a third party fast charger, uh, even if it's not listed in the charger list, the, um, you just set the charger as your destination and it will precondition automatically when needed to optimize the charging. Basically, if you're using third party chargers, you're going to get now preconditioning, battery preconditioning. So you get the best, most optimal fast charging experience. Now I can't show you this because in my area, I don't know of any third party non Tesla, uh, fast chargers so I can't navigate to one uh, but but it's fairly straightforward what it does if you navigate to one it will automatically uh, do the battery preconditioning as needed the next one is rear cross traffic chimes so this one uh, in one of the previous updates they added where on the backup camera the edges would be red if there was cross traffic coming from whatever side now it'll also play a warning sound in that direction so if someone's coming from the left the sound will be on the left side of the car left side speakers and uh, or the, or if they're coming from the right it'll be the right side speakers so I'm going to show you uh, where that is to turn it on and then also just minor other updates I guess uh, they, they uh, weather is now displayed both for final destination and waypoints okay I mean if you need that the battle of polytopia uh, there's a new, a, a new skin if you play the games. Uh, there's also security fixes and minor other fixes. So let's show you how to set the chime. So we're going to go to s controls, safety, and rear cross traffic. So we're going to go to, uh, let's see here, safety, and somewhere here we should see rear cross traffic. Whoops. Unless it's already, is it already on? Let's see. Now turn Joe mode, lower volume, down. gear chimes, park assist, speed limit mode, glove box pin, allow mobile app. Rear cross traffic chime, there it is. And it's on by default. So they turn it on by default, there you go, rear cross traffic chime. So that's all the features. So there you go, that's all the features, pretty good. I like the rear cross traffic chime. In case you don't notice the red, it's a good good thing uh, and some other little updates um, like I said I don't really use I only use well I really only charge at home and when I do need to supercharge I use Tesla because it navigates me there but if you use a third-party non Tesla fast charger this is good for you so again thanks for watching thanks for subscribing and again if you haven't yet click that subscribe button and we'll see you next time